Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to another episode of Hearts Farm 4 Modern Day Vatican City. Whew. It's a long campaign. This has become a very, very long campaign, but I still very much enjoy it. Just how you could spawn from this very, 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 very small city with 800 people now to 900 and this mighty empire we have right here. So, last episode we discussed should we go on China and I think we will. It's more exciting that way, but I need to reinforce everything. So first of all, Afghanistan, you're gonna disappear from the map. I don't want anything that should be able to maybe interrupt me or anything like that. Uh, you should basically surround them and bring that one down. While you, 24 units, your order is gonna be uh, something like this. And just, well, basically go down right here. And then I'm gonna assign the other lines, these 18 when they're done with uh, done with Afghanistan, to basically be this line and go upward. So I'm gonna try to split it right here at Nepal, as I decided last time. And hopefully it will go quite well. And in the meantime, let's try to get some more tanks up out here. <coughs> uh, my current boats are defending well, right? Uh, yes, uh, let's even add... No, all of this should be fine. Hmm. Let's see, what current... Oh, they have nothing left. Really? We wiped them out? Okay, we have you now assigned at the same position. Just kill them. Just kill those destroyers, please. What? Whatever, whatever. We have basically full control right now. So just in case, let's split you in two. Let's give you a commander. Uh, this commander, search and destroy in these three areas. And the other commander... You're gonna search and destroy in these. So basically have full control of an entire Mediterranean. And it's finally, 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 finally our Mare Nostrum. So yeah, basically our, our Mare Nostrum, um, RC, but whatever. It's our Mare Nostrum. Alright. You tanks, when you are done, we can actually make this line. When I think about it. You. All of that. Upwards like this, and I want these. Let's see. I want six of the you to go right there. Well, whatever. Let's say eight of you, and then we just remove two of them as reserve units or anything, or something like that. I want to start just fine war goal against you. That's gonna take 120 days or 60 when you are done. That's gonna be worth it. So we wait and then start just fine. Cool. <coughs> Outdated equipment. Generation 3 mechanized, that's not acceptable. Generation 4 mechanized, please. Generation 4, where are you? Right there. Let's see. Actually, let's just do this. That should probably go faster. <laughs> oh, crap. We no, that's gen... Oh, crap. N crap. Now I removed all the production efficiency. Let's see. We are losing... Oh, we lost, like... We lost 40% because of my mistake. I was like, ooh, white. There. God. Damn it. Uh, mechanized, 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 mechanized. Even more, please. Thank you. Continue. And very good. Yeah, cool. You're not complaining anymore. Then just continue. So, China, how about this? How's your Air Force? Pretty goddamn scary. Hopefully, I have higher tech ones, but um, I'm just going to deploy some as reinforcements. Just some defense right here. Uh, let's try to find my. Is that mine? Gotta be mine. Then you assign like like 500 right here. I want 500 down here. And I want 500 here in the north. Just like I said, something just very, very small amount. I don't want to see rocket bases. Um, I don't want to see carriers. I don't want to see actually air bases. That's the one thing I want to see. Hmm. Hmm. So the only thing I want is right here. So I need to remove at no, no, you actually are also kind of fine. Eastern France, no longer needed. Central Sudan, no longer needed. No longer needed. No longer needed and no longer needed. So all I have is 200 right here. The rest are called back. Very good. Now I realize that I canceled this one too. Anyway, it's fine. It's fine. I can just re-put these one. 500, 500 cool and then 500 in the north too uh, was that my base yes it is my base but it's completely destroyed that one too 400 here's one more just why a very small amount I really want to just distract them 
from when I hopefully push into their territory that they will be focused on, well, my territory instead of their own. So basically I'm defending my own land as a distraction. <laughs> cool. Now I have superiority right here, very nice. And then it's just basically activate your mission. Uh, actually, let's not have any missions right now, otherwise you will just take air accidents. Alright, Afghanistan, how long? Another 20 days. God damn it, I want to begin my war with China right now. I'm hyped for it somehow. It feels like um, it will go quite well. Though I might very much be severely mistaken, so... Um, yeah, we'll see. Alright, these five tanks. What are you doing right here? I don't know. So let's just pull you over right here now. Uh, actually, remove all orders you currently may have. And then just those five. Very good. You should be going away where we have complete superiority. Very nice. So on my main island, we no longer have any tanks. No tanks should no longer... <laughs> More like we should not have a single tank defend anymore. Uh, garrison, why? Yeah, that, these two are important enough to actually deserve a tank. Not anywhere else, though. Here's a tank. Okay, tanked. You're justified. Actually, this one should also be a tank, but... Well, I don't want to take time. Oh, right, 22 tanks right here. How about you moving to something a tiny bit more important, like uh, the Chinese front? Or they could technically still invade me right here. Hopefully they won't. Well, I have all my other divisions in position right now, so hopefully it will be fine. So, let's move you up to, well, Assault Division. So, 69 tanks are gonna be invading poor little China. Well, poor little China there. China have taken over India and... Uh, are not that poor either. So I think it's going to be a hard, long, difficult battle. But once we win, because I have no doubt in my mind that we will win, it's going to be awesome. We're going to finally be able to fight eye to eye with NATO. And especially, well, United States, England and Canada. The three nations I have to fight and bring down to finally find like, a peace. Actually, not Canada, but United Kingdom and United States. Your current fleet is pretty big not the biggest one it's your fleet that is my biggest pain well yours together is kind of pain actually wait wait oh no i looked at canada before yeah both united i was a bit surprised but yeah both united states and england has a horrible fleet that i really want to deal with i only have 53 i have 104 factories so i have more than them but it still takes a very long time to actually build a very big fleet so um how we actually build naval bases everywhere where we can build yeah, we have. God damn it, I was so hopeful for a second. <laughs> Three more naval bases. So this is basically why I invade China. I want these 68, maybe. And that would be... Well, that would help our... That would speed this game up quite a bit. And of course we can't, well, deny the manpower, the military factories and the civilian factories we are hopefully gonna get. Uh, declare war, very nice. Uh, so, right, someone told me to watch out for Turkmenistan because they are reactionary. Yeah, like, I'm just gonna ignore these nations. I'm going straight for China. Uh, right, we have a war goal right now. Let's justify 60 days. Awesome. And which division? These 18. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're just joining NATO. Whatever. Let's just bring you down. We have you completely surrounded. Very, very nice. Slowly, but steadily. Surrounding and then the finishing blow Boom Thank you So you 18 now, please join this force and you should not be executing any army right yet Ex any order <laughs> right yet um, <coughs> <coughs> That kind of looks like my land, but still not Tajistan owns that single province Oh, so you must also be at, or you must have also been at war with NATO. You managed to take one province, and you still kind of exist in that one. All right, uh, these six divisions. Who are you assigned to? All right, you're twenty. Oh, those twenty-two. Where's these? Where are the five right here? All right, I'm gonna first assign you five to you on these 
and you 22. I'm just gonna grab the first two of you. And sign right here. Oh, no, no. Right there. Actually, we don't need two anymore because we assigned five. And I counted all two. Come on. There. There we go. And what's this front? Let's remove that one. So 21 units right here. So where should you be put? Where should 21 of these tanks be? Oh, I have an idea. Let's just assign you to this general front. You're not going to have any... Actually, your offensive push should be both of these lines. Yeah, you don't have even close enough troops with that. But just a general one that can fill up gaps that can be... Well, the behind the line that will just protect my other troops. If they fall back somewhere, push, push too aggressively somewhere, you're just going to be the backup, basically. Uh, 31 right now over here. Oh, right, that means you must be deployed right now. Uh, you're no longer needed right there. Well, actually, you're kind of needed, of course, but... Um, you're gonna join the backup division. So, let's see. Who were the backup division? You. You're a level 3 one. I want a level, uh, I want a, well, field marshal with 60. So, well, more units can join you. And let's see. Lathium. Why we were only produce? I think it was because of manpower reasons we were producing so few. Let's add a couple more. And you're gonna be on permanent production. Actually, once I deploy you, cancel. I want 10 on permanent deployment all the time. <coughs> or production, training, whatever you want to call it. All right here, no. So let's do fire brigades. Let's just continue down this path and get the organization because that's what we need just now. I think bringing out China will give us all the manpower we possibly might need forever and forever, for, forever and ever. Hmm, sound volume. What the hell? Uh, unread nail, nail battles, a submarine, one more submarine, one more submarine, and one more submarine. Weird. You should not be able to get in here. We have complete control everywhere. I don't care. Your submarines should not be able to land right here. So still you somehow get in here. Is it still this fleet that is somehow distracting and still... Or do you have some random submarines placed somewhere? I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, China in how many more days? It's gonna be in 34 more days. I don't see that many troops stationed right now al along this border. Actually, they have concentrated right here in the center, but you should have lots more than that. 250 or something. So um, I wonder where they are. They're probably scattered along this border against Russia. They actually might be seeing Russia as a much bigger threat than me, even though, well, no, I'm actually just fine war goals. So. Hmm, at least some troops against Russia most likely. But um, they're gonna feel, they're gonna know how wrong they were when they stopped defending against me. Everything is still fine, yes. Actually, this is, oh right, German ones. So let's just continue the improved relationship right here. So we can keep this one. Because I really want that one for when eventually our generation 6 tanks are coming. Generation 6 main battle tank looks kind of ridiculous to be honest. Like small wheels. Feels like a downgrade. It looks like a small tank right here, a small tank right here. Like every single wheel is a tank. Like, just add guns to them and they're perfect. Come on. 18 more days. I'm excited for this. Crap. They're now really just amping up how many troops there are in border. Will either like I have two two ideas how this will work out. I will break through, make some progress, and then just completely get stuck. Or I will break through and just run them over because well, I don't think they're that well. Their troops actually they are pretty good. Okay, never mind that won't happen. So either I will push through and then get stuck, or I will just get stuck instantly. I'm hoping pushing through and then stuck, but. Um, We'll see. So you are going to be... Wait, wait, wait. You're the backup. Yeah, you're going to be on balance manner. So you can basically, well, hold the line. While the other ones are aggressive, right? Yes, cool. Supply is almost perfect. Are you maximum prioritized? Yes, you are. Um, ports, yes, we also have them. Everything is fine. We have done everything we can. 
Actually, somewhere a naval port should probably be upgraded first. I can't actually find you. Oh, wait, here. First of all, never mind. Never mind. <sighs> Anything we're missing? I guess I can always add some more main battle tanks. Oh, wait, that was a Mark... Oh, right, right, these were better than a Mark V. That's why I ignored you, because these are really upgraded. Okay, then let's get some more of these. Two more lines, maybe? Oh, we're actually missing steel right now. That was a very long time ago. Cool. Uh, let's see, can we trade steel with anyone? <laughs> with China. <laughs> so, um, we're probably gonna take... Well, since you can't trade more with you, so I, w I guess we'll just have to take the steel right away from you. That's our causes belly. Not manpower, not I'm afraid. We need the steel and you won't actually give us more. We'll actually trade us more, but... Shh. Causes belly. And one more day. One more day. Come on. <laughs> Did you get completely stuck there? No. <sighs> Are we really doing this? We're playing as the Vatican City, declaring war upon China. A China that has taken over India. Is this a good idea, Daniel? Is this a good idea? I think it is. I think we have to do this. <sighs> Alright. Alright. Let's do this. Vatican City goes to war. May the heaven help us. I think the heaven is gonna help us. So, execute, execute, execute. All our hopes and dreams basically lie upon the tanks right now. We have no other naval invasion. We have nothing to worry about. Our homelands are secure. We have a large army. We currently have 3.6 million men in the field. But here is the main push. We have all our tanks. 77 tank division stationed right here against the China. It's how many tanks are there? There are 28,100 tanks. It's 9,000. Well, actually, it's 55,000 mechanized, it's 4,700 motorized rocket artillery, and among some random small stuff. 98 nukes currently going, but we won't, well, we won't get air superiority. That's just, we won't get it. So I'm just trying to distract them a tiny bit right here. I don't want to unpause. I'm just really afraid. No, no, it's still gonna, no, no, yes, no, yes. I'm thinking of speed 5, or if I should push down. No, I'm a speed 5 player. I'm a speed 5 player with pausing. Why am I so afraid of this? We have done this many, many times before. I think it's just because I've been with this campaign for such a long time now. We've built it up for ages. Got me to uns. Initial engagement. Looks fine. We're breaking them. Alright, so we're gonna break them and then most likely gonna get very, very stuck. Uh, let's help our tanks as much as possible with, well, not getting stuck. Try to get, oh, overrun. Very nice. <coughs> You're pushing quite nicely. Let's see if we can break them right here. Get in right here. Uh, let's see, it's extreme micro mode going on. <laughs> Push right here. No, you're gonna halt. You're gonna attack right here instead. Okay, you were actually done right there. Very good. Crap, I knew nukes were gonna start flying. That's just gonna destroy my infrastructure, so I need to get and grab their infrastructure, basically. Get up here. Super important that you don't get around me, otherwise I might just completely lose this. So, four, no, were you free tanks? No. Free tanks. Stay right here. Two of you, right there. One of you, right here. The four of you go up right here. Come on, up. Two of you attack right here. Other two of you attack right there. Very good. Very good. Okay, we're doing quite well. How are the losses currently? 10,000 versus 455,000. Okay, I think we're going quite well for now. Um, volunteers, yes, please. All the volunteers I possibly can get, I will accept you. And let's see, how are the fronts going right now? It seems like we need to push in a tiny bit more right here if we want a good front split. Actually, it might work quite perfectly. Come on, just get in here. 
to get a to get an attack right here, increase combat width, and if you push up right here, then it should be a perfect split at Nepal. Halt. Okay, halt. Oh wait, you're from different units, that's why you won't halt. When I tell you to. But it's going really well. It's going extremely well. Over expectation times ten. How is this possible? Okay, we have split it. And let's see, we have one, two line. Actually, here we have a tiny line right here. You should not be here. You should be dragged out right here. U24, you should all be assigned right there. Right? And two. What the, what the hell happened with this line? I must have deleted wrong or something. Alright, U24, all 24 should be assigned right here. Half of you should be assigned right there. Half of you right here. Okay, it almost worked perfectly. Still, I'm very happy with the result. Better than expected. Expect. 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 Better than I expected. Ugh! <laughs> what the hell? What kind of sun was that? Uh, a small alien. Oh, we're just walking in. We're walking in. 16,000 versus 500,000. But how's that possible? Your divisions should be not super well but at least quite well we're going in our speed is just too much for them i think they never have a time to regroup and recharge oh crap we're winning we're winning i think definitely god was with us got me tons Please go in right here. Just bring that one. Kill that unit. Come on. And then we're gonna bring down Goa. Nice. Surround. And continue. What? Where the hell are you going? I, I won't. I know that you're supposed to be very aggressive, but that's ridiculous. Come on. Break this unit right now. I want nice and. I wanna split you up more um, well more clearly all right so we have this order that is basically both lines we have this order and we have where is walking in we're walking into china we have good supply we have good amount of men i have nothing to do i love it <laughs> <laughs> I really didn't want to throw away this entire campaign for some reason. And we're definitely not doing it. We have done well right now. We have slowly, we have waited, we have taken it easy. And right now, we are the Vatican City. Or should I say the Vatican Empire. We're doing it really well. We're crushing them. We are crushing a super powerful China, India. With Vatican City, Vatican City tanks. Let's see, is Fister Pope still alive? I have no clue which division you might be in. Oh wait, have you actually died? <gasps> no, no, you're still here. Where are you? Oh, right here. I must have missed you then. <sighs> that would have been horrendous. I want at least one of them. We only lost one before at the sea, and I want at least one of them to still survive. Then they have really been with everything. Just imagine the stories from that division. Um, yeah, it must be something like Julianus' diary. The man... Who, actually, if you haven't checked that out, um, in the description, there's... Oh, God damn it, I don't remember what his name is now. Oh, I'm sorry. But a guy writing Julianus' diary about a soldier... Well, traveling all over the place and just following his diary with every episode of this campaign. That it's freaking brilliant and uh, I, ne I need to somehow, I, I should probably compress it somehow. And I don't know. Hmm. I, I should make a video diary out of it and just make that a series. And then just have each of them linked in every episode. <laughs> that could be kind of funny to do. Uh, oh, no, no, no. You are not surrounding any of my units. Save that unit now. I don't demand what's needed. You should charge in and save them. Go in right here. Cool. You are now not surrounded anymore. And actually it seems like you would be surrounded. Revenge. 
you are continuously nuking, actually you are nuking your own territory. Which, if I'm not completely wrong, will actually reduce your national unity right now. And it will. Actually, you're, the air is really unwilling to nuke their own territory. But it must just be that the pressure from all my tanks are actually... Oh, crap, you have not been executed for such a long time. That's why you're not pushing forward. Anyway, um, just my presence or, or the force of all my tanks being right here must actually just... Well, pull that value over and just, we need to nuke our own territory, even if we lose natural unity. That's kind of amazing. How are we doing right now? Tanks, everything fine. How are the losses? 32,000 versus 843,000. You're going down. Well, right now you have not lost a single thing, right? Just yet, because this is just Indian land. We are very, very slowly pushing up right here. So just make sure that this is the la order you should go to. Actually, have do we have any on the way or anything? No, we just do not seem to have it. Uh, unassigned troops, no. Uh, 72. Alright, how many do we have of the 189? Um, you need a bunch more troops. Well, not a bunch more, but you need 10 more. No, 11 more. So we definitely need to fix that at least. Um, at well, let's deploy at Vatican City, and we will finally have the 189 that, well, really protected everyone on the stairs to heaven. Gave their lives for the holy in the name of his glory. Uh, we don't have to repeat everything again, it's just Sabaton Lost Stand, everyone already knows it. Listen to that song before I, I I've listened to that song almost every single time before I begun one of these episodes just to really hype me up and get into the spirit of Vatican City <laughs> yeah I have actually done it honest to God but <laughs> I don't really even mean to do this I do all of them I get so many religious bad jokes puns during these episodes it's kind of kind of sad Still, I love each and every one of them, and I will not stop even if you all beg me to. Please go in right here, go in right here. Of course, if someone thought it was offensive, that's some other business. But right now, all I, all I read from you is face plan, and that I love. Alright, please just finish this off, and you go in right here, please. Come on, I want to finish off China. I want to finish off China in a half an hour episode. That would be incredible. No? Okay. Then just bring down province per province. Grab it. Then they have two places right here. Bring this down. And you are now surrounded in one very nice province right here. Let's double check. How many losses? 1.17. 1.43. So basically Stalingrad. In Orissa. They probably lost 500,000 men if you include all of these provinces. And there were more to come. More losses to come. Come on, just bring it down. Not many left. You are... Actually, you're basically done right here. Wow. Incredible. <laughs> we finished off the entirety of it. Up, oh, up, up. Don't even try. Don't even try to do that. Go straight there. Fix that. Come on, just bring down their five divisions, five motorized divisions, three motorized divisions, and gone. So that was another, okay, that was basically 800,000 men most likely, somewhere close to that. Holy shit, how will they ever explain that to the people? So uh, U24, I want, hmm, actually, to make it easier, let's remove all your orders. No, 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 no. Right here. Okay, cool. Fixed it. I want 24 of you divisions and you should be going up r like that. Uh, while you 29, who possibly might be here. Just make a tiny, tiny order right here. Actually, no divisions currently assigned right there. So, let's grab you 6 and you're going to be the one executing that. The rest of you will probably move up. While you still have this order to do. Very good. <coughs> uh, 
<sighs> Let's see how many losses have I taken in these areas. It might actually be none. Oh, right. I never... I, <laughs> I never gave you an order. So you never did anything. Whoops. So, uh, we walked into China with their entire air force over us. Our tanks are just unstoppable right now. <coughs> Let's see how good is one of these divisions right now. 37 organization. Yeah. All we needed really was more doctrines right here. This one made the final push and bump that we really needed. Our tanks became godlike once we, well, got over that step. China, let's bring that one down. China, China, China. I love China. Hilarious video. Alright. Anyone assigned to nothing? Yes, you are. I want everyone right here. One division right in here. The rest of you, push forward. You are pushing up. Let's try to push down at the same time. Bring, unite these borders once again. <sighs> Come on. Come on, wipe that out. All the troops right there, very good. So, U29, uh, let's just give you another order, it's too confusing. Orange, everyone should now be right here, and that's your own order. Actually, let's remove it, let's make a new one, and your orders to go straight in here. U24, divisions, top right, remove all your orders, a new one, get up right here. U24 units, well, you have your orders. And let's just continue with them. So gather up, regroup, do whatever you need, and then actually no, 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 not any, and then and then push, go forward, get head on. No more waiting. We have waited long enough. But we'll see if we actually can bring them down this episode. They haven't lost many victory points from themselves. It has only been Indian victory points so far. They have nuked themselves quite a bit though, it's still counted as their territory in that way. So, 47 national unity. Come on, let's just push in. Push in and bring them down. They have no chance of survival. And let's actually make you very, very aggressive also. I want no one to wait for anything. Just get in there. Half of you, come on, let's just push in. Okay, come on, half of you right there, the other half right there. Cool, that will just make this entire thing go quicker. And you can just move up. Very nice. Current losses, 2,064,000. These tanks were just way overpowered. And now we have experience, so one, once we eventually get this one, we can just... I'll upgrade you quite a bit too. And one more one more piece of land. And then it's just the final push into China. Come on. Very nice. So all 24 divisions. Well, I guess just push and grab that one. Come on. You can do it. It's, come on, it's one division. Yeah, sure, it's mountains, but come on, it's it's one division. Oh, actually, you're not attacking, that's why. Cool, now you are. How much more? So, you have no order anymore. Assigning even more troops right here will just destroy the supply even more, so... Your order, 24 units. Like this. Just stay back a while. Relax. You took over the entirety of India almost by yourself. If anyone deserves a break, you do. While the rest right here, just continue pushing. Well, it's not that you don't deserve a break. You have done really well yourself, but... Some people have taken over an entire nation by themselves. And some have, well... Just stood along the front line and done nothing here for a couple of months. So come on. Let's get in there. Let's continue pushing. Uh, let's also do like this. Let's build infrastructure. And let's try to counteract their nukes. 
very nice. So where are we? How many can we actually start building? Uh, let's see. All of you are not being produced right yet. So I want to start bumping up right here, and that should basically be it. All the very important areas are at the top. Yes, cool, and then we then I'm happy with it. Construct repair. I no longer want that. I want construct engineering. How much stuff are broken? Basically nothing if you compare with how much that have been broken during my game right now. It's incredible that we actually managed to do this. Come on, just push in for the love of God. Just go in now, bring them down. I don't think we have to grab very much. You are retreating. Where are you going? You are very slowly moving forward. If you just could grab well, that, uh, this city, that might actually be enough. I don't know, not completely enough, but while you push in and grab that city, you will have pushed forward and grabbed some too. And together, that should be enough. We have Manchu and Hong Kong. No, Macau and Hong Kong. Manchu. Manchu is right here. Somewhere. EU4. EU4 thought suddenly is jumping into my head. Uh, organization and tanks. Alright, let's continue. Backhand blow. How much do you have right now? That will increase it a tiny bit. Actually, quite a lot. 4 plus organization. Very nice. So, pushing like that. You should go in. No, right there. You should go in right here. When the rest of you just slowly but steadily pushes in. How supply right now? Better. Not excellent, but better. And I still haven't built a single infrastructure infrastructure level yet. Come on, bring that one down. We need it. And uh, let's see, alright. Uh, like is, oh actually someone asked me in how do I still think it's fun? Why, why can you do the same thing several times over and over again and still think it's fun? I like it. I like it. The slow build up, even if not everything is super fun all the time. You lose, you make mistakes, you screw up. But then when you have been fighting for, I don't know, how many episodes? 22 plus, maybe? Actually, I'm gonna double check just because of it. I want to see how many episodes currently Vatican City is on. How can I forget about this? I checked this episode just before beginning, just so I would not mess up and miss anything that you've written. So, episode 20, this is episode 21. Most of them are at least half an hour each. Some of them are even longer, some streams, uh, one hour episodes like this one. Actually, this is a 37 right now. And we've just spent so much time slowly building up. It's like your little baby, you've slowly grown up and now you finally see it. In the adult world fighting the greater powers and I don't know you can do so many different stuff and I enjoy that I enjoy it that way and hopefully you still enjoy this campaign all right please just push up uh, you're being a bit too aggressive right now I would like to keep hold the line a bit more right now you can still be aggressive but I want you guys to just spread out and actually hold it a bit more now actually you're moving forward now when we have enough supply Oh well, kind of had enough supply. You are cool, you're already stuck. Please, just grab the capital. That could be it. This, or actually not capital, but big city. Ah, it, is it? No, not yet. Um, but you, if you grab Beijing. Uh, let's see. Oh, maybe the Olympic Games are still there. Maybe we can still ca catch something. <laughs> I think, yeah, didn't it say like 2012 Beijing Olympics? I'm pretty sure it did. So maybe we can still catch the last two things. They probably didn't invite... Oh, actually, that might be our CB. They didn't invite us to the Olympics, and we really wanted to join. So we decided to... Well, if they're not gonna let us join this way, we'll just have to do Olympic Games in um, taking over the nation quickest, or something like that. Cool, now please push in. Push in and continue this. And we still haven't grabbed the capital. No. Come on. A level 10 fort. I know it's kind of hard to break, but... Do it now. Slowly. 
sadly. Just destroy a level or two, and that would be fine. Okay, cool, you're breaking that unit now. And we managed to grab it before everyone reinforced, and is that it? No, it's not. That's actually not it. We need to just basically go in like this. I don't care how you do it, just go in and grab that. I'm holding both my hands up here in the air. If you get surrounded, you get surrounded, but I think it should be fine. Actually, no, 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 let's not, let's not, that's horrible, that's horrible. Hold, hold, fix this. <laughs> fix the idiotic push, you're just gonna get surrounded. Uh, let's do like this, push this one out. Stop, do stop doing stupid stuff, Daniel, you're not that powerful yet. Yeah, surrounded, of course you were. Save them. You're gonna push upwards. <coughs> stupid, Daniel. Don't do crazy stuff, you're not that powerful yet. Sure, you could probably, I might have succeeded with it, but I might not have. And that would have been a catastrophic loss if I lost 10, 20 divisions. It's still, they're quite precious to me still. Yeah, sure, I've taken over half the world now and we're doing extremely well, but I don't want to just throw away troops. It's stupid. Please, just make this one. So this is more a controlled very crazy advance if you might understand what I mean like I still kind of have control over it kind of look at where they might possibly be able to surround us trying to well reinforce the areas so this way you can do a bit more crazy stuff but it's still very much under our control under my control because this is my push not yours this is my victory my glorious moment where I will finally bring down China and we will, though, bask in the victory. I will do the winning right now, the hard pushing, and China has capitulated. Is that it, or do I need to bring on anyone else? No, one day, and we will have victory. We can annex China. Take all states, and turn, done. Vatican City took 65 states, China was annexed, 560,000 equipment. Actually, we're still at war. No, we're not. No, we're not. So, that's only NATO now. Are you independent now? Yeah, you're once again independent. We have 1,121 factories. We have double our size in, well, naval dockyards. Very good. Let's just continue with the whole sea. Uh, let's get some more destroyers, please. <coughs> and what's most important... Every area where you haven't fully upgraded right here, we're gonna do it for you now. And the same thing right here. Just more naval dockyards. More and more. More is always more. Like Kumakun usually says. But anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this episode. I very much did. Like and subscribe and all that nice stuff. And I will see you guys next time where we will... What will we do? Russia? Bye and bye.